Now, as London heats up, the thought of going for a swim to cool off is understandably tempting, but for some it poses a serious risk. Latest research shows that 95% of black adults and 80% of black children in England do not swim. But Great Britain and Jamaica swimmer Michael Gunning is on a mission to change that. He's been to London Fields Lido teaching kids there how to swim. Natalia Hukera reports. Enjoying this weather and having a splash. Swimming should be an inclusive and fun activity for all, but it's not. In England, 80% of young black people and children do not know how to swim, which is why former international swimmer Michael Gunning is on a mission to get primary school children from every borough and background into the pool. Throughout my swimming career, I've always been told that black people can't swim, that I should do a sport that isn't swimming, that I would succeed at. But obviously, I've had a really good career. Like, I've travelled the world, I've represented my country of Jamaica and Great Britain. So I think these kids deserve that opportunity, you know, and to almost smash that stereotype out of the water. Today was an introductory session for students from Hackney's Queensbridge Primary School. And for many, it was one of their first swimming experiences. Um, I've only been swimming twice and today was my second time. It made me feel too good. It was a really nice experience. I felt inspired by Michael because like, it, was, it was my first time trying to swim. One in four children who leave primary school can't swim and the risk of drowning is higher amongst minority ethnic communities, which is why this primary school plans to introduce swimming classes from year one. As a life skill, we want to encourage it earlier on down in our primary school. We want to get them in as they are in today, but between the ages of five and six, because it's brilliant and they love it and they need to learn to be confident in the water. As well as teaching life-saving skills, Michael is also hoping to inspire future athletes. When I was younger and when I was these kids' age, I never had role models. You know, there was nobody who I could really look up to and know that swimming is for me. So I think hopefully, you know, them seeing me, me being that representation that I never had, will hopefully inspire them to take up swimming and just enjoy it. It's hoped educational programmes like this will help challenge negative stigmas and narratives surrounding black people and aquatic sports and maybe help find a future member of Team GB. Natalia Horkera, ITV News. Next tonight, Europe's...